Memphis Animal Services is in need of some help tonight. It sees dozens of animals as a result of what it calls neglect by its owner. Uh, adding to the challenges the shelter is facing, staffing shortages and capacity issues. WRG's Jordan James explains why the city decided to step in and how you can help. The sounds of animals coming from this facility are to be expected, but this large intake from yesterday was not. Our team uh, went to work and we took 65 animals off the property. That included ducks, pigeons, chickens, a goose, a goat, pigs, and dogs. The city issued animal cruelty charges for a property owner for not providing adequate shelter for the animals as temperatures dipped below freezing and ended up seizing the animals. Alexis Pugh, director of Memphis Animal Services, says this will make things challenging for them. So we were already short people due to COVID exposures, due to the hiring challenges everyone's facing. Add in an additional 65 animals on top of that, and it's been a tough morning. Pugh says the owner surrendered 61 animals to the city and will now head to court to try to get back four of them. With winter underway, she says, don't forget about the animals. If you wouldn't want to be out in the cold, your animal probably doesn't either. So please consider when the temperatures are as frigidly cold as they are right now, bring your animals inside, even if you're not going to put them into the main area of your house. Reporting in Memphis, Jordan James, WREG, News Channel 3. Now with the shelter at capacity, Pew is asking for the community to adopt or foster some of those animals. We have information on how to do just that at WREG.com.